deal is not what I think people perceive as being that tiny little animal that's you know been around for about a month. It's actually an animal that's been growing on grass and it's at mother's milk for well over six months before you know it uh, becomes it goes to our plates. Veal is generally always a good eating experience because it's a young animal. It's uh, for another way of describing it, you could describe it as light beef. It's not been through fluctuations in, in uh, quality of pasture. Veal in Australia is not red like anywhere else in the world. They roam in paddocks, they're free, it's natural, it's very clean, it's basically just raised on natural grasses and um, they're reared off their mother. Well, we're looking for a good quality animal that um, has conformation and muscling and, and that, that's been on an upward plane of nutrition. All our veal that we do is hormone free that we send out into the market. We take the same cuts off the veal as people take off the beef. The difference is that the cuts are leaner. Uh, the product's generally, I would say, healthier. It's got a pinker colour. From our point of view, we focus on what customers want and we can supply any cut off the carcass to the customer specifications. At the moment I'm really a bit addicted to the veal melanese, which is um, the veal cutlet crumb that's a bit addictive at the moment. I just seem to be thinking about it every second night, which is not good. 